Hello, welcome to the Christmas edition of Forge TV. I'm here with Golden Weapon Chain, literally half an hour before we're about to go on stage. Actually, Hello, very actually. Half 20 hour, minutes yeah. before Forge TV, this is an exclusive for Forge TV. As you can see though, we're quite relaxed. Yeah, for, you know, The amount of energy that is going to be you know, on show in about spell. half an hour's time. It's yeah. unbelievable. It is it's unbelievable. unbelievable. That's why we're so calm, yeah. we have to keep... <clears throat> I was in bed before I came here. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? You, you want a you know, really nice hotel as well. Yeah. Really nice. Good. Cop form. Yes. So, are you sort of like conserving your energy for sort of after partying and then you sort of sleep in the day as well? Good idea. That's a very good idea. Um, get up late, pop into Nando's or a place where you get dinner, come back, have some food, have a dump, go to bed, and then do a high energy pop show. It's yeah. good fun. You have the shower, then you get on the bus, and that's where the fun really begins. I was, I was drinking spiced rum last night. Oh, that's a strong one. I don't even know what it is, it's so sweet and easy yeah, to drink. Very strong, very strong. And, 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 cans. and last night, right, our tour manager, his missus came on the bus. Yes. She got so smashed. Smashed. I was going to say shitted, but yeah. probably not. Yeah. Quite advisable. Yeah. She got so smashed that this morning she collapsed and had to go be taken to hospital. It hit her head, apparently. Is that what she did? Yeah, she collapsed and hit her head. Oh, yeah. for God's sake. So, uh, so, yeah. so she's, she's, our tour manager's had to go. Uh, I've actually true. completely so the GLC is dangerous. Who's right? going to wash in between my legs <coughs> now there's not a tour manager? Do you know what I mean? Who's going to loosen my trousers in the, at night? Yeah. Last thing at night. Who wipes me up when I'm ready? So you're very demanding on the road. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. You know, we'll probably have to start servicing each other then. Yeah. There's that, a thing called a conga chain that, that happens with certain bands. Mm. It could possibly happen with our band. I, I think it's unlikely. Yeah. But it depends how drunk we get, really. Well, see, it depends how drunk you get because, you know, once the conversation starts, you can't stop it. <laughs> so, back to the topic, you're on your Christmas tour at the moment. That's true. Yeah. You, you like Christmas, it's good. Oh, God, I love Christmas. Do you love Christmas? I, I, I like Christmas. I don't think you like Christmas as much as I do. No, I, I know you do like Christmas. Yeah, I used to really like Christmas. Um, some of it I don't like, but I like the atmosphere, I like the camaraderie. <laughs> I like the friendship, I like the food. What I do at Christmas is I like the films. I, I put on, I've got a cassette, pl a, a CD player, sorry. And I put the, the CD in and I put it on repeat yeah. and it's just Christmas carols. That Often you get CDs given away with newspapers. So our free ships come to All of that sort of thing. I like the one that goes, uh, riding on a donkey, something like riding a donkey. Uh, yeah. On a dusty road, little, little donkey, donkey, little, little donkey. donkey. On the dirt. Steve Rowe. Brilliant. Yeah, I know that one. <laughs> so you going to do anything good for Christmas? Do you know what your main present's going to be yet? What is your main present for I Christmas? I don't know. It's I was going to get a metal detector, but I changed my mind. It's usually, what are you getting your mum? I don't know what's going on. I got my mum. I've already got it. I'm well organised. <laughs> We're on tour, you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, it's, it's a, have you ever seen a TV show, Bread? Yes. Right. It's, it's a, a chicken that, or a turkey that's made out of porcelain. And you can you put eggs in it. And you take the top off. Yeah. Put eggs in it. I don't know what. I just have one when I was a kid. Yeah, yeah. I think they, they've already got one, but if yeah. they don't want it, I'll have it. <laughs> Always <laughs> buy someone presents, right? That you secretly want yourself. So you know, your buy dad you, a gun. Your dad's like, oh great, a Queen album. Yeah. And your mum's like, oh great, a gun. Yeah. I was. Oh, that's cool. Isn't it? <laughs> I was gonna get my mum because my housemate suggested this to me: a calendar where every picture is a picture of me. Oh, that's nice. So that's, idea. Idea. that's like a nice memory. Our, our it's a bit like you might have died. You know, <laughs> they've left your bedroom as it was, and it's been 20 years, but there's still like Airfix models hanging off the ceiling and your school uniform in the cupboard. Yeah. But you haven't really died, you just. Just, moved just, away. just made them, away. merely made them a yeah. calendar. Yeah. So come on in, Adam, come on in and sit oh, down. Oh, sit oh, down over there, quiet. Where's the others? Uh, come in there. Massive vaginas, bollocks. Tit shitter. Adam? Earplugs, is it? Yeah. You do me a big favour. Yeah. You take all your clothes and dance around naked for me. Yeah. I like you, Adam. <laughs> Pretty nice, lad. Oh, you go a long way. Go on there. Get naked. Yeah. Go on. Just take your just take your trousers off, but leave your pants on. I can't believe I've got my ear. These ear defenders to stop me going dead. Uh, do you guys suffer from a lot of build? <laughs> yeah, <it's> tinnitus. <sighs> tinnitus. Yeah, tinnitus. yeah, but you know, put these things in. You're like, what? That's pretty cool. <laughs> Well, final question. Uh, you're at Christmas now, but um, you did planning any festivals in the summer, or what's your plan for the new year? Hopefully, we're going to do all the festivals next mm. year, all of them. Yeah. Even the, the one where people get naked um, up in is it the Isle of Wight? It's a, it's a, a big coming of age festival. Yeah. And it's marvelous. They take everybody who's they have a big load of, of food, and yeah, and then everybody takes off their clothes. 
There's no pressure. If you don't want to, they just escort you off the site. But, you know, you just take the clothes off and we just all lie on top of each other and once, just enjoy each other's company. Once you've, you know, been done, yeah. they, they just mark you with a red cross. Yeah, and then you go again. So.